Welcome back to the channel, y'all. In this video, I'm sharing with you guys another pickup that I got in today. This is called British Sterling for Him Reserved. I forgot what I paid for. I think it was around ten or twelve dollars, fourteen dollars or something like that, on eBay. All right, so I'm kind of interested in it. I saw it. I thought it was pretty cool, you know. Haven't really seen too many. Nobody really talk about it. Y'all see a lot of sense that I pick up. There'll be a lot of stuff that no one really talks about. Because uh, I don't follow the Joneses when it comes to colognes either. So I like to <laughs> come up with some sense that you know, everybody ain't really talking about. All right, here's the, what the bottle look like right here. Kind of mind of the old British Sterling. Um, the DNA of it kind of smells similar to the old British Sterling too, but it's more of a modern take, I would say. Uh, the bottle is cool. It's got like a chrome here. And the half of the bottle is black, like a dull black. Um, cap, it's a plastic cap with a chrome finishing. Just a chrome itemized. The bottle looks very cool. Look, remind me of uh, kind of remind me of the True Religion bottle. Y'all know a True Religion, the Drift, or uh, True Religion, or Drifter. They got like this, you know, give it kind of like an ancient liquor bottle or something. It's a cool bottle. Kind of remind me of the Creed bottle a little bit too, you know. But a uh, pretty cool bottle. Um, I'm sure you got the spray of this baller. Check it out and bring it in. Pretty decent spray. Puts it out relatively fast there. Now, I've been testing this. And I uh, first apply this. Um, you get about an hour and a half to two hours of projection. Now, y'all know me. I'm a, I'm a reviewer that'll give you similar scents. I don't really get it too deep in the notes and all this stuff. This is made by Dana. Um, it's inspired by the heat of the night. It says here it's inspired by the heat of the night. Hair reserves such first that it offers a perfect blend of scotch and playfulness. I guess the heat of the night, like the show heat of the night or whatever, but it says it's inspired by the heat of the night. So I don't know if they talk about the show heat of the night or whatever, but... It smells really good. It kind of give me the DNA of the original uh, British Sterling with more of a modern take. Cap fits pretty tight. You can hold a bottle by the cap. Oh, fail, but fits pretty tight, though. For the most part, this bottle is heavy, though. See here. I don't recommend it, but you can. But you see how it came off, though. <laughs> All right, that being said, uh, it's kind of, it's, it's kind of got the woods. Uh, it's got the, uh, I get like a little mint here. Kind of minty. Now, it reminds me of some of the scent that I tell you guys, it remind me of. It reminds me of 360 Black on steroids, I would say, with more mint and woods in it. If you like Perry Ellis 360 Black, but turn it up about five, six notches, that's what you'll get this. And then add some mint to it. So, not saying it smell 100% alike, it don't, but it have barrel simmons. Let me hit it again. Much as I've been wearing it, you know, I try to get on point similar scents that, it, you know, it smells similar to. I've been testing the longevity with this fragrance as well. Yeah, it smells similar to Perry 360 Black. With more mint in it and a little bit more woods. Now, longevity for this fragrance is somewhere between three and maybe five hours. It's, it's average, you know, y'all know me, I don't really get too deep in longevity because I tell you guys, just <laughs> just spray it again and the heck with it, you know. Um, after about four hours with this fragrance, I don't care whether this fragrance costs $20 or $500, you know what I'm saying? I'm just, 
after four hours, I'm gonna take this thing. I'm gonna spray it down again on me and my clothes and all. As it need to be. That's just how I do. That's why I say I don't get too deep into longevity. Because I believe in just reapplying this thing. Smell good. Now, best out of rock this fragrance, I would say anytime, casual, um, date night. I like this bottle with it gray with it saying right here. Reserve. Got a little, I guess, Great Britain, British. I like where the chrome is made. The ball is made with the chrome all the way around. You know, it's a pretty cool presentation. The box is just nothing special. It's a black box with British sterling on it and a reserve. Nothing special about the box. But the, the fragrance it smells amazing. Very modern. Uh, like I said, it reminds me a lot. It's got kind of Jean Paul Gaultier Lamal vibe to it, too. I get that with more of a menthol, with more a little bit of sweetness, um, a little bit more woods. It does give that John Paul Gorte, the original Lamal vibe too. Yeah, it smells good though. It smells real good. Now, I will rock this on a date night with my wife, or my girlfriend, a night out. Just going to grab some dinner, just going out shopping, going to having fun. Yo, know, that's 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 where I would wear this. Honestly, I wouldn't do too much casual wearing it because to me, I think this fragrance is somewhere around twelve to fifteen dollars, something like that. Even that, that is a little expensive just for sitting around the house. Now, you know, that's just me. I would save it still for the wear out and the night out, even if it costs fifteen bucks. You know, we ain't wearing no fragrance out in the yard. You know, you know what I'm saying? Just play around with some cars or something. We could do a dollar fragrance for that, but yeah. Good scent. That's my review of it. Three to five hours longevity. About an hour to a half to two hours of projection. Uh, Y'all look into it. Y'all look into it. It give me the vibe of Rock Aware Evolution, too. Um, If you like Rock Aware Evolution, you'll like this one here as well. Kind of think of it now that I'm smelling it. It give me that rock aware evolution vibe as well. Kind of cake mixy. Incest is slightly. Yeah. And Perilous Black remind me of Rock Aware Evolution as well. Yeah, if you like Rock Aware Evolution, you'll like this one. They got similar vibe going on there. So anyway, hit that subscribe button. Hope y'all enjoyed the review. Y'all stay tuned for my next video. It's British Sterling Reserve for him. I hit you guys on the next one. I'm out. Peace.